Hi right, guys, welcome to this edition of River Bites. Now it's been a while since our last one, we know, and this could be the last one of 2016. Mm. Or we may be able to sneak one a more Christmassy themed one before yeah. the year ends. So what are you guys going to be doing this Christmas? Are you going to be out catching ghosts of Christmas, past, present and future? Or are you going to be stuck at home, snuggling with your little loved ones in a warm, cosy fireplace? You're going to be drunk, hopefully. Well, you've got to watch out for Krampus, Krampus this year. Yeah, uh, that's what happens when I drink too much. I get the Krampus. Well, I, yeah. it, it kind of pays me a visit when I have too many Brussels sprouts. It's not good. So, yeah, if, if you've had too much Brussels <laughs> or too much ale and you get a visit from Krampus, drop us a line and let us know. So, on tonight's edition, what are we going to speak about? Yeah, what are we going to speak what about? What are we going to speak about? What have we been doing and what are we going to be doing? Well, in our absence, it's been, I've noticed online, I don't know if you guys have, um, there's been an upsurge in photos with a green orb. In. Yeah, I saw that. I thought it was just like people flicking bogeys about and shit. It, it could be that. I mean, what was it? Um, a few months ago, you had the legendary red circle that way seemed to be in photos, but I never saw one of them. But nowadays, yeah, have a look at these pictures that we're going to put on, on the screen now for you. Um, some green orbs there. It seems to be a current trend. And this particular set, these three here, the person who took these believe it's the picture of this fella. What, Alex? <laughs> no, not Alex. The picture that's <laughs> on, on the screen at the moment. Oh, um, yeah, really. How they make that connection, I don't know. But um, that's something we're still looking into. So we're not going to go into it too much depth on this one, but I have just noticed an upsurge in that. So if you've got any pictures of green orbs like that, orbs, um, then put us our way. Like, going so by... Pictures of your orbs. Going by these pictures, it's, it's safe to say it's probably lens flare more than anything else. So that, that's that bit. Why out is there never anything interesting, exciting? I don't, I don't know. Or lens flare or dust. Because um, when you've done nearly 20 years in a field like we have been, uh, things um, yeah, things mm. tend to be a bit mundane. But they're not. They're not mundane at all. Honest. That's why, that's why I'm still here. Anyway. Uh, it is Tuesday today. It's Tuesday. It's River Day. Mundane was yesterday. It was yeah. indeed. Yeah. Moving on, because we've got nothing left to say on that. Nothing more entertaining. No, we haven't. Um, so yeah, our updates with Ripper. Hmm. So, yeah, what, what, what have we been doing that you think, what the fuck have they been doing? Yeah, well, um, a lot of people out there are still saying, what, what's happening to Reed Trust? A lot of people are saying, what the fuck are Ripper still doing about? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought to ask myself that question. Yeah. Oh, what am I still doing here? Right, okay. Ouija trials. Um, if you've been keeping up with our, our Facebook page recently, then you'll know a little bit about this. The Ouija trials is still going ahead, but we put together the pilots, not the final edit, but it, it's getting there. The reason why it took so much time is a combination of factors between uh, the software we're using, the editing suite, time, and the fact that we're not overly happy with how it's turned out on screen. Now, this is nobody's fault. Um, it's just the concept that we come up with and now we've filmed it. It isn't. It hasn't turned out yet. It hasn't just turned out as, as exciting or as, 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 as tight as we want. Watchable as we want to do. Yeah. You know, it's. Um, but that's not to say we're going to abandon it. We are going no, to condense no. it. We're going. We're still going to put it out there. But it's it's just every all the editing we've done, we just have to redo and go back to the drawing board and put it in a different way. Looking at changing just the format of how we're going to put it together. Yeah, and tweak it. So it's going to take a little bit longer. So yeah, we're yeah. grateful for all the support and all the followers and the likes that we've had um, regarding Region Trials. It I don't is know, obviously the guys that came around and filmed with us. No. Oh, yeah. Obviously, I mean, they're the ones who, who make the show and obviously they're the ones who are waiting can to you remember that. their names? I can. Go. Is this so you can't? No, it's just you can't. <laughs> I put you under pressure. Okay, well, we had Guy. Yeah, full name. Shout out, Tom. Guy Whitcomb. Whitlock Coombs. Whitlock Coombs. Oh, I said Whitcomb. <laughs> um, Janet Bingham. Um, Lisa Stewart. What <laughs> the fuck is Lisa Stewart? <laughs> no? <laughs> no. We had a Lisa, didn't we? Nope. Where's the one beginning with S then? Sarah. Sarah. Sarah Lewis. Sarah. That's like Lisa Stewart, isn't it? <laughs> Sarah Lewis. Um, Nye Nissi Desi Press. Dini, yeah, we'll do that. That's okay. Yeah. Um, we we did have Lisa. We had Lisa Montany. No, what was her name then? It's Amanda. Amanda Montany. We we did have Lisa. That was it. That was it. That was it. 
Jimmy. That wasn't too bad, was it? Three out of five for that. And, uh, at least it might have been the spirit at the board. Yeah, it might well have been. Yeah, have been. But, yeah good effort. <laughs> However, right. From doing the Ouija trials, we've come up with a concept that we came come up with we've a concept take, we came up with ages ago. We've gone. We've taken a little tangent on it. Took a step. Back. We, we've taken the time skew. A bit, if you think back to Back to the Future, when he does his little yeah. diagram of the time skew. Yeah, we've gone back <laughs> to we've bring you something in the future. And when we've taken the time skew there, so we Ouija trials is there. But when I say honey, you say G. You need to say honey. I say G. Oh. H to the O to the N to the E to the Y to the G, it's Honey G. When I say honey, you say Fuck off. Right, we're going to bring to you a project called the Seance Sessions. Now there is oh, a okay. no, no, uh, the Seance Sessions, there is a little trailer down below. Um, if you're watching this on Facebook, it's down below. I'm going to look for it. If you're watching this on YouTube, I don't think it's on YouTube at the moment, but we will put it up there. Are you trying to find something there? Yeah, um, a little trailer. Is that what you're calling it? Little trailer. It is a little trailer. So the seance sessions, um, it's basically exactly what it says. It's going to be a sessions of a set. It's going to be a collection of sessions regarding seances. But you're invited. Okay. It's um, we need. It's going to be five people in total. Well, each episode is going to be different, isn't it? Yeah. We're going to, we're going to basically do the eight instead of seancing. So obviously the first one seance it is a word seance so a you know depending on what area of the seance we're, we're working on it will depend on how many participants we need for that particular show but generally it will be four people four public and one medium now ideally we'd want the medium to be changing um, to suit their gift yeah, to suit the seance. Place, he's going to start stinking. So if he could have yeah. a change, maybe a little bit of a wash would be nice. That, that would be nice. Yeah. But mediums don't usually do that, do they? So, moving on, um, we've got a series of, of, of the programs. So, we were looking for a medium who does some given value. Let us say a port. Now, an port is an object from beyond that will appear during a seance. Now, if you're a medium and. Is that like the old Toffee Crisp advert? That's the one. That would be in the port. So if you're a medium who's got experience can of like hiking... So people can see it, so they know what we're talking yeah, about. Yeah, let's play the video. Speak to us, Sydney. Are you there, Sydney? Are you there, Sydney? Sydney? <laughs> Somebody somewhere is having a toffee crisp. So if, if you've got experience of something like that and you're a medium and you're used to doing that, then give us a shout. You're the person we're looking for for that. And let's go on to B. B. What do we have for B? Oh, what did we have for B? We've we got, we must start there. learning to write <laughs> things down. When we, when we brainstorm. Yeah. Um, let's go Banshee. board. Board, yeah. Board as in Ouija, Ouija board. board. All right. They might not be board, but let's just, for conversation's sake. Well, it'll, board it'll, it'll is like board. Becky's at the moment. But... Oh, bless her. So, yeah, a board. So, if you're a medium who's got experience working with a Ouija board, then we want you for that. And so on and so forth. So, you kind of get the idea. Now, the way it's going, it's going to be set in an um, ambient surrounding, intimate, cozy setting, as you can see again on the Sound ses Sessions video. So, that is our next main project. Mm -hmm. However, nearly Christmas, nearly New Year, brings us into 2017. 2017, we have shitloads of projects to kick off. Now, we're kind of stepping away from public investigations. We have been for a while. It's not something that we meant to do on purpose. It's just how it's gone over time. We're going, we seem to be heading more into the creative world of the paranormal. And some of the projects we've got lined up for next year will be interactive social studies and shows. Now, when I say shows, we're not on about most haunted type or ghost hunters or anything like that. We're on about serious social studies where we can experience what people who are in a haunted surrounding, you know, what they actually go for. So these aren't going to be celebrities. They're not going to be ghost hunters. Well, some of them might be. But, you know, they're just going to be general people like you and us, I guess. I think that's a good way to say it. I'm glad you didn't say normal people. Normal people. No, general people. Um, we've got a show, we've got Lockdown coming up, we've got Midnight Game coming up, we've got um, Three Kings, which we're looking forward to, um, and a few other things like that. 
And the location that we're working mm. on to host these is fantastic. So yeah, we'll probably will do the standard ghost investigation there. So if you're interested in that, keep your eyes out on yeah, the Facebook yeah. page. As, as Alex said, you know, we're, we're cutting down on the public investigations. It's not going to say we're going to stop them completely. So do keep an eye out for some rare public inve investigations and yeah. events and stuff. So it's going to make it more even more special when we do do one. And also for next year, new season, remember, we need more people. So if you want to take part in these new, new studies that we're doing, then drop us a line. Mm. Now, we're looking for creative people, we're looking for people with an interest in paranormal, we're looking for um, people, <laughs> we're looking for enthusiastic people. You may have noticed we're, we're down to three here now, our table's got smaller. So and we've got moving on. Beck behind the camera. So, yeah. We'll Waving behind the camera. <laughs> she, she you can waving. see that from there, can't you guys? So, yeah, we, we can get a bigger table if you want to sit behind here and be on the ripper bikes with us and... Yeah, be part of the panel. Be part yeah. of the panel. Talking of which, that's another show we've got coming up. We've got Spirit Level coming up, so keep your eyes out for that. We've been hopping on about that for years, and that has actually been on TV once, but um, the commission got pulled on it. Not through our fault, but because the studio. So, yeah, keep your eyes on that, and we will be um, recruiting one of those people for that. So, yeah. If you want to be part of a, of <laughs> so, a potentially busy, busy team in 2017, drop us a line. Very busy indeed. If, yeah, put it down here in editing. If you want to, cheers, mate. If you want to be on this side of the camera or that side of the camera, then we want to hear from you. Okay. But if you want to be on that side of the camera, you got to fight Beck. Ah, uh, there's two more cameras. You got that one. You got that one. But Beck's on the main one. So yeah, get your asses right into us. Get your asses behind these cameras or in front of the cameras. We want oh, to hear from postcard. you. Postcard. <laughs> get your asses on a postcard. No, no, no. You don't have to do that. Your asses on a postcard, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Doing asses, not asses. Going live and all that sort of stuff back in the day. Asses, not asses. So, yeah, I think we've pretty much covered everything. You did. Yeah. I think we've pretty much covered everything that needs to be covered. Is there anything we've left out? We're speeding through this because of time constraints, but... Yeah. Um, no, I think, that's, I think that's it. I think, yeah. Those of you that was watching this on uh, Facebook Live earlier, sorry. <laughs> we, we appreciate you you're taking time out to try and watch us, but hey, technology, that's what we're doing this. If you all joined us... We wouldn't have to do it live because you'd be here. Yeah. That'd be cool. So join. Oh. And we're going. What was it? Because the advert said, you're awesome. What advert that we're talking about? This one coming up. Tune in next time. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye. Are you troubled by strange noises in the middle of the night? Are you experiencing fears of fear and dread in your basement or attic? Have you or any, any family member witnessed a spook, spectre, or ghost? If the answer is yes, then don't waste another minute. Pick up the phone and call the professionals. Ripper! Our courteous and efficient staff are on call 24 hours a day to serve all your supernatural elimination needs. We're ready, ready to, to believe, believe you! you.